where I decided that I wanted to tour, um, but I can't also have an apartment while I'm touring. So I'm like sort of homeless right now. My name is Karima Walker. I'm a musician. I didn't go to school for music. I don't have any kind of um, formal training around it. I had been living in a religious commune for like four years. Really learned a lot from that experience, but I didn't know what kind of work I wanted to do. It's been like a gradual process of like letting myself do it. Even though it's like really challenging trying to make all these pieces come together, it's really satisfying. I work here part time and I um, I substitute teach and then I, I play gigs that are going to pay me more but maybe aren't like the heart of what my project is and that's okay. It still feels really good to play those sets, even if it's not the type of material that I'm like actively exploring right now. People eating dinner is sort of like the show, <laughs> and I'm kind of like just sort of providing the ambiance. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Love folk music. That was sort of the seed for like my own writing in the beginning. As much as I really enjoy um, the songwriter material, I knew that I wanted to change something. There were just things that were not being expressed that I would experience like in the process of writing a song or just in my day-to-day -day life. I could express it lyrically. It wasn't quite enough. I think I wanted to like do sort of an overhaul. I wanted so badly to be good and to like live a good life. I was like mostly raised Catholic and then I was um, part of an Anabaptist community. Those are real concrete practices that I think um, can be really rich. And so to decide like, oh, I'm, I'm not gonna be a part of a community like that anymore, well, you know, do I just like start doing yoga? Different parts of the creative process were a lot like different like spiritual experiences that I've had. Making music um, has taken the place of what religion was. I 
want there to be like a huge breadth and that does represent a lot of like my experience of being alive. I was really interested in like, well, how can I like take over this whole room, but still also like be quiet? So I stopped worrying about um, having like a linearity to things and I allowed my songs to become more like, more filled with imagery. To know that like you're pursuing what you want to do and you're willing to make sacrifices for it. Um, and there is a return on that. There's confidence that comes from that and there's um, a community that starts to form where you start to notice like, oh, there are other people who are like all in also um, and that's a very exciting thing. Thank you.